met a gypsy. But he, you know, if you think about it, I remember when I went to Loretta's when I was a kid, um, I would go over and walk over by the Team Green Pits and just look at Adam's bike and be like, holy crap. <laughs> yeah. And then everyone at Loretta's knew what time the Super Mini 1 moto was and the Super Mini 2 moto because Adam was going to race. Yeah. And then you go to the lo- or you go to the fences. The fences are lined. You can't even pull your golf cart up to the line to the fence because Adam Cincerillo is racing. <laughs> yeah. that, that's really how it was. And I was like, and it, it seemed like something that wasn't real to me. I would walk over and I would see Mitch sitting there at the pro circuit, um, at the pro circuit semi. And then Adam's bike was over the team green thing. And it was just like, wow, this isn't real. And, and so, so he's you had compare, a microphone to him yeah. when he was 10. You and know? you compare that to your life. Yeah. And so it's, it's just so different. Yeah. yeah. And, and that's why like, it's pretty cool how in, in sport or in our sport, there's so much much difference. Um, we talked about it kind of before on the podcast, but or before we came on, um, I think like our sport needs the like look at the Lawrences and, and their um, the way they go about things. Deegan and then me, we're all so different, and, <laughs> yeah, and we're that's all so three different very in different people. so many ways. Yeah, yeah. Um, and there's and let's throw Nicoletti in there. For yeah, <laughs> exactly. And it like how cool is that that we get to have so many different personalities. And I, I think that that can allude back to where we're all the same because in general life, all of those personalities exist, those yeah. types of people. the um, Yeah, there's a lot of Phil Nicoletti's in the world. Yeah, and the, <laughs> yeah. I, like I don't give a crap and like the the showman, like there's all of them or the, the, the humble guy that just does his thing and yeah. you can count on him. Um, that just happens in all work. So it's it's, I think, really fun for the fans to be able to see the personalities come out. And I think in the last, from what I've seen, um, in the last few years, you know, multiple years, a lot of personalities have come out more. Yeah. Um, when I was younger and I would watch like Carmichael and those guys, they they were just so exceptional at racing. That was all I really knew. Which back then there wasn't so much social media. Um, and but it was it was far different too. Like the camaraderie between riders wasn't there. Mm. Like um, Carmichael and Stewart or Carmichael and yeah, they Reed, didn't talk ever. They didn't talk. No, <laughs> absolutely not. They certainly didn't train together. <laughs> yeah. You know, now we have a lot of us training together, and it's it's just changed a lot. Um, and different things work for different people. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The what we were talking about before, I guess, is pretty cool the way you said it you know like there's a there's the Deegans of the world and they make you look better but you make the Deegans look better because totally. you're super boring compared to like the Deegans but the people that love the exciting flashy guy can hey, hey go hang out with him they make mm-hmm. you know you make him look better yeah but he makes you look better because you, you're just the nicest guy in the world you know like you're that humble hard-working midwest boy that everyone can relate to yeah, you know, and it's like without you, you can't have one without the other. Exactly, I I totally agree, and that's you know like if depends on what you want to follow in yeah, the sport, yeah. you know, or what you want to be a fan of, and and no harm, no foul to any like yeah, you like yeah. mint, you like chalk chip, exactly. <laughs> yeah. yeah, so um, it's 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 pretty cool that I guess it's pretty cool for me that I guess to make an impact on others, yeah. and as an athlete and as a racer, yeah, I never would have imagined. If you enjoyed this content, please like and subscribe. And to listen to the full three-hour podcast, search Gypsy Tales in your favorite podcast platform or click the link in the description below. Gypsy Gang.